Hello, this is Andre Battles of How and Why, the Bible Answer Guy, with another devotional from our book, Jesus Calling, for February the 25th of 2024. Rest in Jesus' presence. Rest in Jesus' presence, allowing him to take charge of this day. Do not bolt into this day like a racehorse suddenly released. Instead, walk purposefully with Jesus and let Jesus direct your course one step at a time. Thank Jesus for each blessing along the way. This brings joy to both you and Jesus. A grateful heart protects you from negative thinking, and thankfulness enables you to see the abundance that Jesus has showered upon you. Your prayers and petitions are winged into heaven's throne room, where they are permeated with thanksgiving. In everything give thanks, for this is Jesus' will for you. Our scripture reading today is from 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 18. For everything give thanks, for this is the will of the Father in Christ Jesus concerning you. There's a line in today's devotional that says, a grateful heart protects you from negative thinking. And then I guess you can say that the opposite is true. A heart that is not grateful, a heart that is always complaining, redirects you from Christ, pulls you away from his presence. A heart, I guess you could say that the opposite is true. Because a heart that is filled with negative thinking, because a heart that is not grateful, is filled with negative thinking. It's really that simple. What are you thinking about? I know it's easy, you know, in my relationship with my wife, it's easy to think about all of the things that she does that I don't like. And trust me, there are a lot of them. But at the end of the day, you know, if I only consider the things that she does that I don't like, sooner or later we'll be headed to divorce court. Why? Because my mind is filled with negativity. That means even the things that she does well, even the things that she does that I appreciate, I will begin to hate simply because... I am thinking negative, so that's what my mind will be looking for. That's what I'll be bracing for, the negative. I've got to learn, and so do you, to live in the positive thoughts, to live in a spirit of gratitude. It doesn't matter if there are certain things that are not happening the way we want them to. I mean, that's life. But you learn to bounce back and adjust by thinking about the positive instead of the negative. Well, once again, this is Andre Battles with another devotional from our book, Jesus Calling. Thank you so very much for sharing this video, copying and pasting the link, texting it to your friends and your family members, loved ones. Thank you for posting it in Facebook and in Facebook Messenger. You're getting the word across. Continue to do so. And I will see you by God's grace right here tomorrow.